Hi there, this is Jules with Scott Leroy Marketing, just coming in with a tip video. And this tip video is going to be how to get a PDF onto a smart plan. So there are a few steps that we'll have to do to um, get that PDF to be on an email step in a smart plan. And I'm just gonna walk you through that today. So a few things you wanna have up. So I do have my PDF that I'm wanting to add to a smart plan. But actually, in order to get this onto a smart plan, this PDF needs to be a JPEG or a PNG. So I'm also going to walk through how to get that converted. So I just uh, looked up a converter online. So the one I found was pdf to jpeg.net. Um, there, there are many options for converters for PDF to JPEG. Uh, this is the one I chose. So you can click choose a PDF file here. Choose your PDF. And then click convert PDF to JPEG. Now it may take a second here, it's being processed as you can see. Um, and just a heads up, I am in Firefox Incognito. Um, this will work the same in Chrome, um, but it just may look a little different on your screen if you're viewing that. Oh, so here we can go ahead and download that file. So I click download here for JPEG pictures. And I can even pull that up in my downloads. So I can see here that now this PDF is now a JPEG now a JPEG so it can be used in email designs. Now going back over to command so we're going to go to the design section of command so if you tap this red KW in the top left to expand those out we're going to go to the design section. Next, we're gonna click Create Design in the top right. And we'll want to choose Email. It's Email Step or Email Design. And Continue. So we're actually gonna start one from blank, so in the top right here. And we can go ahead and uh, title this. So I'm just going to title it Smart Plan PDF. Then you can click and drag this image widget over to the, the email editor. So if you click and drag over to the left here and drop, it will give you some few options here at the top. We'll want to Click over to the Add Images tab. You can either drag and drop, or you can actually click right here to open up all your files. And we want to grab the PDF, or I'm sorry, the JPEG. So that converted PDF to a JPEG. And double click. Then click on this picture. So you'll see that this has been selected and click save. So that will get this image to display onto the email design. And you can even click on the pencil icon here if you'd like to make further edits. So you can link that to something, you can change the width and height, border radius and position. So I'm gonna make sure that's centered. I'm gonna click center and done to get that to pop these changes to populate. And then I can click save in the top right. So you'll see that's been saved. And once you get that message that's been saved, you can go ahead and click the X and also go ahead and save the changes again. There we go, just took a second. 
All right, now that we have this PDF in an email design, we can add that to a smart plan as an email step. So we can go over to our smart plans. So the smart plan section of command. For this, I'm just gonna create a new one. So I can click create in the top right. And I'm just gonna name this making a move. and apply. So now you'll see when you select to send email steps, so if you want to add that in, you can go ahead and click on it. And then under email type, this is where you can click that design. So instead of simple, we'll want to toggle over to designs and we can select an email design from here. So it's first gonna show the KWRI templates, but we'll tab over to my design templates. And we'll see this email design right here. And you can click to, to add that in. And there you go. So that will add a PDF uh, to a smart plan. And yeah, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out at support at scottleroymarketing.com.